from your weather authority. Here is Chief Meteorologist Randy Turner. A severe thunderstorm developed in the northern hill country about an hour ago. It has turned into a tornado warning for parts of Mason County. Here's the entire radar. Of course, nothing happening here in San Angelo. Looks like we have missed out again, but this is a very nasty thunderstorm where you see the pink. That's going to be hail larger than golf ball size. There is radar indicated rotation right here about Pontotoc, and this storm may produce a tornado. Tornado warning in effect. It is moving toward the east at 25 miles per hour. So if you're in Cherokee, you should seek shelter, Chapel as well as even Llano, and maybe even San Saba. But right here across northern and northeastern Mason County, northern Llano County, southern San Saba County, that's where the worst of the weather will be going. And this tornado warning will last until 545 this afternoon. Just the northeastern corner of Mason County involved. Severe thunderstorm watch has been issued until 11 o'clock tonight. McCullough County and Mason County are included in that. It extends over to Lampasas, up to Waco, and all the way down to Austin. So the hill country in for some stormy weather. I think this is just the first of what will be several storms right here on the north side of Austin. Severe thunderstorm warning in effect. Let's bring it back here at home and you can see the past several hours of cloudiness kind of moving out clear for a bit and then clouds coming in from the north in behind a cool front. You probably felt the temperatures kind of get warm. We started out warm and muggy and then it's turned into a little bit cooler. 72 degrees. Our uh, humidity is 53 percent. We have a north wind at 15 miles per hour. Still have the big upper level low spin out here over El Paso. We've got a batch of thunderstorms in the panhandle. We have another batch that started here in central Texas. They've raced off into Louisiana and Arkansas. And then in between, we've got this new line of thunderstorms building from near Wichita Falls down to the thunderstorm I showed you there in Mason. We still have some of this energy yet to cross the area tonight, so I'm keeping a slight chance of thunderstorms in the forecast as a result of that. Look at these temperatures right now behind the coal front, Sterling City 61 in front of it, 92 down in junction with a lot of 60s and 70s in between. Check this out. Midland 54, Roswell 44, and Amarillo 42. Chilly air up there, 98 degrees down in Laredo. Our winds are gusty, mainly out here, Big Lake and Ozona, some 30 mile per hour wind gusts as you see the rest of the area. So big weather system front creating thunderstorms from the Texas coast all the way to Dallas as we go through the night tonight. This system rapidly moves out. We're left with clear skies tomorrow and things will improve around here. For right now, 20% chance of isolated thunderstorms. Going to be chilly tonight, about 45 here overnight low. And tomorrow, 68 morning clouds, p.m. sun. It will be windy tomorrow from the north at 20 to 30 miles per hour. Here's your forecast, Thursday, 78. Friday, Saturday, Sunday, windy, but we warm up into the 80s this weekend and the low 90s Sunday and Monday.